So, I'm playing Satisfactory, and I've been using these very inefficient hypertube cannon designs, which require a decent amount of power, and they actually don't take you very far. So we're gonna jump in this, and uh, just kind of show you how far it brings me as an example. And this is actually gonna bring me to my newer design that is very efficient and uses a fraction of the uh, hypertube entrances. So this is the new design. Um, I'm calling it the base cannon because when I made this I had 20 and I immediately shot up into the stratosphere and died. I had tried 15, still died. I tried 12, still died from this guy. So right here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We have 9 and basically why this works so well is the Mark IV belt. I'm sure it's better with a Mark V even, but um, basically you get a running start down the belt. And I don't know if a lot of people know this mechanic, but when you're sliding and then you jump out of it, you get a little tiny speed boost. So we're gonna combine that with the speed that the Mark IV belt gives me. And it's gonna take me back to where we just came with like a third of the amount of, or half of the hyper tubes. I'm gonna jump on this here and okay, that was a fail. Let try this again. Now this song is not copyright free. Okay. All right. Yeah, let me on. Let me on. Let's try this again. and we fly an insane distance. It's literally half of the hyper tubes, and you know, we could have made it like to that waterfall right there. Um, but what I'm gonna do is show you guys how to build this, and I'm gonna try maybe 12, and I'm gonna lower, I'm gonna lower the output of the cannon and see if I can get from that side of the map where we just were all the way to the other side. Um, so we're gonna try and go from right here all the way down to... Okay, we're gonna start here and we're gonna try and get to here. Um, completely across the map. Maybe 12 to 15 hyper tubes, but I'm gonna cut now. Um, I'll build it with uh, some fast forward and give it a shot. Okay, um, we got most of it done so far, but in case any of you guys don't know how to build one of these, I'm just gonna redo these last five right here. Um, it's kind of a tedious little process. One thing I've noticed that I should mention is if you, if you bring them up like this, if you bring them up higher, um, they seem to shoot you out a little farther. And basically, um, this is like the tedious part. You have to grab your hyper tube and just, you're connecting this to this. You're just making a connection between these two. Hyper tube, boom, boom, boom. Okay. And now I'll uh, fast forward through this. We're just gonna be deleting every other one. And uh, now, once you have it looking like this, let's actually see how many we have. 13, okay. I wanted to try 12, we might need 13. We'll see how this goes. Um, anyway, so when you have this set up and everything connected in the middle like that, you're gonna be deleting the, um, from, your, from your start, you're gonna be deleting the connection to the second one, but you're gonna be leaving this. Ok, 
Okay. What I like to do for the, I guess the, the takeoff, if you call it, is grabbing a half foundation. And it just seems to be like the perfect distance. I usually go right about here. Um, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna make it super steep because we're gonna try and go pretty far with this thing. Maybe that. And we're gonna connect it with the noodle hyper tube. Should be nice and smooth. Just like that. Okay. Just double checking it. Okay, all those are good. Um. Next, we're gonna grab our power poles. Just, I like to give each entrance its own connection, just to be a little more clear. Okay. Oh, I forgot to connect these. We have that. Now we're gonna attach our hyper tube entrances to each one of these. I'm liking the look of this so far. Just make sure they're all connected. Okay. Checking our connections. Now we're gonna, I'm gonna drag power up here really quick. I like to give it its own little power switch in case you need this power at some point in the future, you can just turn it off if you're not using it. Connect this up. Um, name is the base cannon. Oh yeah, now we just need to add our belt. Beautiful. This is just what I intended. Um, we might actually overshoot. Ugh. Yeah, we're we're overshooting where we wanted to go. We might actually die. Out here. But yeah, as you guys can see, this this design is extremely efficient. It it is insanity. Um, feel free to try it out. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments down below and have a satisfactory night.